Isaiah chapter 24, roughly page 431 in the scriptures. See, Yahuwah is making the earth empty and making it waste and shall overturn its surface and shall scatter abroad its inhabitants. And it shall be as with the people, so with the priest, as with the servant, so with his master, as with the female servant, so with her mistress, as with the buyer, so with the seller, and as with the lender, so with the borrower, as with the creditor, so with the debtor, all stations of people. <clears throat> the complete the earth is completely emptied and utterly plundered. For Yahuwah has spoken this word. The earth shall mourn and wither, the world shall languish and wither. The haughty people of the earth shall languish languish, for the earth has been defiled under its inhabitants, because they have transgressed the Torot, changed the law, broken the everlasting covenant. Therefore a curse shall consume the earth, and those who dwell in it be punished. Therefore the inhabitants of the earth shall be burned, and few men shall be left. Almost like a, like a remnant. A new wine shall fail, the vine shall languish, all those glad at heart shall sigh, the joy of the tambourine shall cease, the noise of those who rejoice shall end, the joy of the lyre shall cease. No more do they drink wine with the song, strong drink is better to those who drink it. The deserted city shall be broken down, every house shall be shut, no one enters. There is a crying for wine in the streets, all joy shall be darkened, the gladness of the earth shall be gone. The city is left in ruins, and the gate is stricken with destruction. For thus it is to be in the midst of the earth among the peoples, like the shaking of an olive tree, like the gleaning of grapes when the grape harvest is done. They lift up their voice. They sing of the excellency of Yahuwah. They shall cry aloud from the sea. Therefore, praise Yahuwah in the east. The name of Yahuwah Elohim of Israel in the coastlands of the sea. From the ends of the earth we shall hear songs, splendor to the righteous one. But I say, I waste away, I waste away. Woe to me, the treacherous betray, with treachery the treacherous betray. Fear and the pit and the snare are upon you, O inhabitant of the earth. And it shall be that he who flees from the noise of the fear falls into the pit. And he who comes up from the midst of the pit is caught in the snare, for the windows on high shall be opened, and the foundations of the earth be shaken. The earth shall be utterly broken. The earth shall be completely shattered. The earth shall be fiercely shaken. The earth shall stagger like a drunkard, and it shall totter like a hut, and its transgression shall be heavy upon it, and it shall fall and not rise again. And in, the de and in that day, it shall be that Yahuwah punishes on high the host of exalted ones, and on the earth the kings of the earth. And they shall be gathered together, as prisoners are gathered in the pit, and shall be shut up in the prison, and shall be punished after many days. And the moon shall blush, and the sun shall be ashamed, for Yahuwah of hosts shall reign on Mount Zion, and in Jerusalem, and before his elders in esteem." O Yahuwah, you are my Elohim. I exalt you, I praise your name, for you shall do a wonder, counsels of long ago, trustworthiness, truth. For you shall make a city a heap, a walled city a ruin, a palace of foreigners to be a city no more, never to be rebuilt. Therefore, a strong people praise you. The city of the ruthless nations fear you, for you shall be a refuge to the poor a refuge to the needy in his distress, a shelter from the storm, a shade from the heat, for the spirit of the ruthless is like a storm against a wall. You subdue the noise of foreigners as heat in a dry place, as heat in the shadow of a cloud, the singing of the ruthless is subdued, and in the mountain Yahuwah of hosts shall make for all people a feast of choice pieces, a feast of old wines, of choice pieces with marrow, of old wines well refined. And he shall swallow up on this mountain the surface of the covering which covers all people and the veil which is spread over all nations. And he shall swallow up death forever, Yeshua. 
and the master Yahuwah shall wipe away tears from all faces and take away the reproach of his people from all the earth, for Yahuwah has spoken. It shall be said in that day, See, this is our Elohim. We have waited for him, and he saves us. This is Yahuwah. We have waited for him. Let us be glad and rejoice in his deliverance. For the hand of Yahuwah rests on the mountain, and Moab is trodden down under him, as straw is trodden down in the water of a dunghill. And he shall spread out his hand in the midst, as he who swims spreads out his hands to swim, and he shall bring down their pride together with the skill of his hand. And the high stronghold of your walls he shall bring down, lay it low, leveled to the ground, down to dust. Bless y'all. Shalom.